Welcome back Guardians to another Destiny video and in this video we are going to be looking at the Iron Banner vendor which has been leaked on Reddit by a trusted source Mega Man EXE4 for the March 17th return of Iron Banner. So Iron Banner is returning on March 17th. Now Mega Man is very very trusted in this stuff and he has released what inventory that Lord Saladin will be bringing with him. So let's have a quick look at it. So First we have the Iron Regalia Boots with Intellect and Strength equipped onto them. Followed up by the next set of Iron Regalia Boots with Intellect and Discipline on those. So boots are definitely coming back and chest pieces are also coming back. So we have the vestments with Intellect and Strength on it. And another vestments with Intellect and Discipline on it. And you can see the amounts on screen. And then next we are into the weapons. So one of the weapons that is coming back is the Jolder's Hammer Light Machine Gun. Now I really liked this gun when I, when I had it. I dismantled it by pure accident. Um, it's a really, really good LMG and it's definitely worth getting. But the rolls that it comes with is kills with this weapon reduce the cooldown of your grenade. And this weapon grows more accurate the longer it's fired. That second perk for the longer it's fired it grows more accurate is very, very useful for this LMG. But you can also go and reforge stuff at Lord Saladin to try and get the rolls that you wish. And then the next one we have is the Auto Rifle Silimar's Wrath. Now I didn't particularly like this weapon but the rolls that come with this one are this weapon has increased stability and the bottom half of each magazine causes additional damage. They are good rolls for this Auto Rifle specifically. It's very much like the Atheon's Epilogue but just a little bit better but without the void damage. But it will be very useful in Crucible, in my opinion, if you could get it with those um, rolls. And I don't know what the second set of perks could be, but if there was an, another increased ability as well, this gun would be unstoppable, in my opinion. So those are the things that are returning, as well as the normal shaders and bonds, etc, etc. Um, let me know what you think about this and whether you think this leak is real. I believe 100% that this is real. If this is real, are you happy to see these weapons and armors come? If not, what would you want to see Lord Saladin bring? Leave those comments in the comment sections below. Give me your thoughts, guys. If you wouldn't mind taking one second to hit that like button, it helps my channel out immensely, and I fully appreciate each and every one of you who do hit that like button. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you in the next video.